School district is continuing to look into a new planning software system called PeopleSoft after it has shown glitches. The district uses it for things such as payroll, benefit packages, and getting supplies. APC 7 Jackie Kelly talked with Manatee County School Board Chairman Scott Hopes and tells us what the district will do to solve this problem. Jackie. Scott, this new system went live on July 1st, and since then they have seen many different glitches, such as not being able to order supplies like toilet paper to the schools. Hope says the district is working with a consultant and a firm familiar with the software to help fix any problems the site is facing. He says some problems the district faced before the system went live is the consulting firm was responsible for that was responsible for the implementation of the software went through bankruptcy. The district also saw turnover of people in their own organization who were working on the project. Hope said their old system was supposed to still be running along with the new system just in case they saw these problems. And apparently, uh, regardless of the number of times that I questioned and got assurances that indeed we were going to run parallel systems, uh, uh, we found out in the first week of July that someone in the administration made the decision to not run parallel systems. Now the district doesn't know if they'll have to spend any extra money to fix these glitches. And as for payroll, they say by today they should know if they're able to use this new site or if they'll have to do this pay period by handing out paper checks. Reporting live in Manatee County, Jackie Kelly, ABC 7, your Suncoast News.